if your SSD is corrupted and your files are gone. In this video, I'll show you how to recover data from a corrupted SSD using free and easy to use tools. First, let's confirm if your SSD is still showing up. Press Windows plus X and select Disk Management. Check if the drive is listed. If it shows but says raw or unallocated, you have likely got file system corruption, which can be fixed. Before you rush into recovery, it's super important to check the health of the drive first. If the SSD is failing, running recovery software directly on it could make things worse. So I made a quick and easy tool to help you assess your drive's health before you start scanning. It is called the Ultimate Drive Health Checker. The download link is pinned in the comments. No installation needed. Simply open the downloaded zip folder. Right click anywhere in the folder and extract it. You can extract it to your desktop or any folder you like. When done, right click on the tool and run it as an administrator. It will scan your connected drives and show what's healthy and what's not, which will tell you if it's safe to continue. If your SSD checks out and shows no warning signs, then you can move on to the actual file recovery. We will use a free and powerful tool called PhotoRec. It can recover files even if the drive is unreadable or raw. In the address bar, type www.cjsecurity.org wiki test disk download. In the home page, scroll down until you see the Windows version. Click under the link that says something like Test Disk 7.3. That is the latest development version and it includes both Test Disk and PhotoRec. Don't worry, this tool is free and safe. It doesn't require installation. Once it's downloaded, open the zip file. From there, right click inside the zip folder and choose Extract All. You can extract it to your desktop or any folder you like. Let me break down what you are getting, just so you don't get confused. The Test Disk Windows Executable is the test disk recovery tool used for partition, repair, and more advanced recovery. It is command line based. PhotoRec Windows Executable is the command line version of PhotoRec, which has no interface, just keyboard. Kill PhotoRec Windows Executable is the graphic user interface version, which is perfect for beginners. Double click on it to launch the graphical version of PhotoRec. Once PhotoRec is open, the first thing you will see at the top is a list of all storage devices connected to your computer. Look carefully and select your corrupted SSD from the list. You will know it by its name, size or brand. The next step to take is to select the partition type. If you are not sure, leave it as default. This works for most Windows systems. Only make a change if you know you are using a Mac or Linux system. Otherwise, stick with the default. Now it is time to choose where you want the recovered files to go. This part is very important. Never save the recovered files back to the corrupted SSD. It can overwrite your data. Click the browse button and choose a healthy drive or USB with a nap free space. When done, it will show the full path selected. Now everything is ready. Just click the search button. And PhotoRec will start scanning your SSD for recoverable files. You will start to see recovered files appear in the output folder as it works. Depending on your SSD size and speed, this may take a while, sometimes even hours. Once it's done, Go to the folder you selected earlier. You see a subfolder named Recap Directory. Inside them are your recovered files. Some files may be renamed and some might not work. It depends on how badly the data was damaged, but most files should open just fine. So this is the easiest way to recover lost data from a corrupted SSD without paying for expensive software.